Hello, hi guys. Welcome back. Um, so, today's video is a little bit less um, traditional than normal. So, I really wanted to do kind of like an organizing video. I have spent the last couple of days like really cleaning out my closet and um, bathroom and nightstand because I'm trying to make room for my boyfriend who is moving in. Um, so for today, I want to do kind of like a organizing my makeup drawer video because I think that I can make that kind of tingly for you. So let's go ahead and get, 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 get into it. So I also kind of just wanted to show you what my closet looks like right now because I'm like um, so I, well, I cleaned out a lot of it, but, and I had to, like, organize my, um, bathing suits into a basket and my t-shirts into a basket, but it looks way better. I still need to do the top up there, uh, but I just bought a new hamper, too. And I would say that once I put these items up there, it's going to look way better than it did before. And um, there's like maybe a quarter of the closet now that I'm sharing with my boyfriend as opposed to like one sixteenth. So that's good. Um, sorry that the lighting is so, so weird. The bathroom actually has a fan attached to it so or i mean the <laughs> the bathroom light has a fan attached to it so if i turn it on it's gonna be really really loud and you won't be able to hear me talk at all so we're going based off of the closet light and the bedroom light which i know is like really awkward but that's kind of how i have to do it for this video start off my organizing extravaganza. So I bought this like wooden organizer. just want to be able to suction off types of makeup because right now I just have them thrown into a drawer and it's not organized at all and it looks awful. Alright, let's get, let's see if I can do this. So, so right now it kind of looks like this. And this is after I cleaned it up, if you can believe that. I kind of like organized my products into different bags, like a foundation bag and a, I don't know, eyeshadow bag and a lipstick bag and a uh, new products that I haven't even tried yet bag. So that's kind of how I want to like, hello, are you going to help me organize? <laughs> so that's kind of what we're like going with or maybe some some different um 
products in each section. And then I also got these like organizers. Except I'm not sure that I'm gonna actually use them. Although I could put one of these in like the big section of my wooden organizer. and like blush and skin things here um, and then maybe the products that I use the most here because I have like my everyday staples that I will touch every single day and I have to have those broken out into their own area which has always been this bag for me but we're gonna try something new and we're gonna see if it works so going through here I have my mascara that I use every day my well I actually have two eyebrow pencils but I'm only using one of these so maybe I should put this one with my new products that haven't been touched yet. Okay, so here's my brow pencil. And then I've got my eyeliner. That's my black. I have another mascara that I sometimes use. It's like a sample size one. Um, this little like wonder stick that goes with the foundation, but I'm just going to keep it with these products. really don't want to. Hmm. I'll hold on to that mascara. It's like a little eyeshadow that I never use. So I'll put that in the eyeshadow category. Here's a brow pencil that I also, oh, I only use it if I run out of my other one. So I guess I will keep that as an everyday staple. everyday products and they fit really well so I'm super excited about that now I'm gonna move on to um, the eyeshadows which are in here so I have my ELF which I actually do use quite a bit but apparently not enough to make it into the main category. There's a specific that I really don't use. Um, I'm learning is I literally have 
have so much crap that I just don't touch. <laughs> um, okay, let's see what else. Another like little one. They're always just like one, but I, I just don't use them because I like the eyeshadows that have multiple, like this one. This one I use. No, not every day, because uh, it didn't make it into that category, but I do use it every time I wear eyeshadow. So I'll put that over here, too. And then I have, oh, this is oh, Orza. These are kind of dark, though. I use a lot of dark. Okay, so now the eyeshadow is full. the skin items for skin we have oh this should this one should be every day this is my uh, poor professional primer is it called is it Too Faced poor professional it's matte And then there's a super setter that goes with it to set your makeup. Um, oh no, this is my Too Faced Hangover Primer that I love. And then my, uh, what's this? My Lawless Conceal the Deal uh, Clean AF. Foundation. And then I have my Sephora foundation. Um, two more primers. And then three little tiny sized um, liquid foundations. I still have room. And what I kind of want to do is put like my powders in here now, um, like my face powder, Sephora, my Sephora bronzer, and my um, blush. So those will all fit in here. And then I'll put my setting powders right next to it. So I have like three of them right here. in here and then I have this blush bronzer combo okay so here's what we've got so far we have the little wooden organizer that's fitting in here and everything's pretty decently organized here's like my everyday products my powders and foundations and setting powders and primers and then in the back is all the eyeshadow I just discovered that I can fit two two of these in the drawer and then I'm gonna have all the room over here which unfortunately these don't fit um, unless I like I guess I could stack them if I really wanted to Maybe I'll do that so I could, um, because I kind of want to put, like, these guys in one of these. That actually could work. I have, like, my nail filers and some hair things there, hair clips. Um, oh my gosh, what if I put all my scrunchies in here? life-changing because I have them on this thing right now and they look it just looks like kind of trashy so if I put them in there that, see, that looks better okay and then I really just have to put um 
Oh, where's my hairbrush gonna go? Shoot. I mean, I could put it on the top of everything. Um, I could also, let's see, here's like all these random things that belong to my boyfriend. is like perfectly organized and I just like I'm just like hey here you go your, your stuff is just like thrown into the corner there <laughs> okay anyways so this is gonna be for my lipstick I think um I just don't think it's gonna fit all my lipsticks though because some of them are like long like this lip liner one by one and see what happens. I never knew I had so many lipsticks. I mean, I guess they fit. Or maybe I need to just pick the ones I actually use. like about as good as I could hope for. What do we think? We've got um, nails and hair, lipsticks, random medicinal type of things, and sunscreen, hair ties, um, foam things, whatever those are, everyday makeup, a brush, comb, skin items, and eyeshadow. I mean, it looks so much better than it did before. So, thanks for tuning in today. Um, I hope that that was relaxing. I know that was kind of like a different sort of video. Um, but let me know if you like it. Let me know what you think. Or if you have any other like organizational ideas. Um, this one was kind of easy because I could do ASMR with all the different like makeup products. I think it would be harder to do that with, like, if I was organizing my closet. But, 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 thank you for joining me. I hope that you have a lovely, 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 lovely rest of your day.